Okay, let's take a look at some basic sketching skills. Before we get started, I want to talk about some of the tools you might want to use when you're doing some sketching. Now, obviously when you're doing sketching, sometimes the, the need just hits you and you're out and about and you just grab a simple pencil. You may have uh, some little pencil, something like this, just a cheap little pencil. And you may have a sheet of paper, you may have some post-it notes available. All of that is fine for basic sketching. Uh, on the go when you when you have a quick need and that's an important skill for engineers and technical illustrators and and draftsmen is to be able to just sketch ideas on the fly so whatever you have around just grab it and go so I might have this you know I might have another sheet of paper like this or I may just have a napkin so whatever you need so that's uh, just a quick way to get some sketching done now if you're going to sit down and do a actual session where you're sketching and you're trying to do a more professional sketch, I recommend a good drawing board, which is what I have here. Uh, the reason I like this drawing board, and this is the Rotring doll, uh, drawing board, it's got a little uh, magnetic clip holder here for your paper so it keeps things steady for you. So just a, a nice inexpensive board for you to have. Uh, I also recommend that you have some basic things with you. I love having dividers available. Dividers are excellent for transferring distances, so I like to have those available. I like to have a good pencil. This is a, a .9 with a soft lead. Uh, I've got an HB lead in here. I, I typically like to have a .7, but for demonstrations on camera, the .9 will be a little bit wider so that we can take a look at that. I also like to have construction lead. Now this is a, a lead holder, and this has anything from a 2H to a 6H lead, which is a very hard lead. And what that's going to do is allow me to create some very light construction lines. So I'll set that to the side. I also like to have, of course, the eraser. Now I love these erasers because you've got lots and lots of eraser in there because I make lots and lots of mistakes. So it's good to have that. So an eraser. So again, an eraser, a lead holder, a mechanical pencil, preferably 0.7. Now a lot of times when you, I should also say, a lot of times when you buy those you get a 0 0.5. 0 0.5 is okay, but 0 0.7 just gives you a little bit better uh, line quality. And then again, dividers for transferring and measuring quick distances. So those are the tools you need to get started. Now in the next video, we'll actually start drawing.